Letters is a choose-your-own-adventure, story-based puzzle game that uses words to influence the scenery. It's a perilous tale through the writings of Sarah and her pen pal that meshes different art mediums and styles pretty well. The adorable atmosphere mixed with the humor in the form of puns, references, and parodies make this journey a daring yet fun quest. There are three different stages of life in this game, and each stage of life has its own quirks. Wow, just like real life! The first stage of life is four levels long, second is five levels, and the third stage Stage is the epilogue, which honestly doesn't have much besides an adult Sarah walking through the results of her own life choices, similar to me when I remember a dumb decision I made years ago. Stage 1 has a disclaimer at the beginning, which means you know it's about to get real. After creating your slightly customized character, the intro plays and drawings come to life. Stage 2 introduces the computer scenes, which are really cool because there are a bunch of different sites that you can take words from, each with their own theme. One scene that stuck out to me was the Trojan virus that infects the computer and fights the antivirus armadillo, a fun little minigame that happens in the middle of the story. Regarding all the stages, however, hints, cursors, and words to find are always available when needed which I'm jealous of because I'm always available, yet no one texts me! Audibly, the music transitions are so smooth between vibe zones, and when the emotion changes, the song and color grading switches with it. Which means you'll definitely hear about it in your diary that journals the more you play with your controller to find little Easter eggs such as 6 p.m. games instead of 5 a.m. games. Time travel is a very important aspect of this entire game, since each letter is its own specific date in time. We will now time travel ourselves to understand the consequences of the character's actions, which is what Kanye West and Joe Rogan should really be doing right now. Oh, what's this? Mom's in discomfort with divorce on her mind? Yeah, this can't be good. I want to help, so let's go through the mom door. That sounds wrong. Oh great, now mom is into crystals and is basically an MLM hun who is also in love with the cult leader, just like your mom. Yikes. Listen, I'm all about girl bossing, but this is a bit much. This can't be right. Oh, okay, let's try again. Okay, so this has to be the better option. The dad door. Still sounds wrong. Looks like now he's working all the time. He needs a better uh, work-life balance. <laughs> Relatable. Anyways. Oh great, now he's in the hospital with a drug overdose. Ah, so basically, whoever you stay with will just get mentally ill. Leading us to believe that both conclusions are, yeah, talk to the parents about their problems so it doesn't get any worse. Here's what I learned from time travel. The game does a good job at having some of the choices actually impact the story. Not every single choice you make will have a massive impact, but some of the choices will actually affect the storyline. Not all, but some choices. There are two ginormous plot points that base the entire story around it, which is mom and dad, and are the main conflicts. Six major plot points that affect the storyline, which appear in the epilogue. The rest are minor plot points. Wow, plot points. <laughs> Okay. The rest are minor plot points which affect the story in the form of words on the page, placement of the characters, and how some characters felt changed, but these minor changes do not affect the ending of the story. Therefore, the degrees of change between the three types makes your actions actually have consequences, which makes the story different when you play it for a second time, giving the game replayability. Now, there was definitely some familiarities in letters between differing storylines regarding the parents, gameplay, and epilogue. No matter which parent you went with, you see the dark side of them like a burnt piece of toast. While you can't affect the divorce art, what does change are some words that are highlighted occasionally in blue letters, character types, the day when you finish a level, and Sarah's looks, which carries over to the last level. In here, What's familiar is that Katya, Sarah's pen pal, does not change her pages, and that the major changes, what internship Sarah gets, which parents you went with, where you stand with Alex, where you stand with your sister, where you stand with either Leela or Tim, what job you got, and then it always ends with Sarah flying out on a paper airplane, literally, to see her pen pal Katya. Letters is a journey of friendship, divorce, relationships, work, and dreams that all revolve around how saying the right word matters, how important family is, 
and that feeling anxious about important decisions in life is normal. It shows how everyone has their own stages of life that they go through. While Letters is a choose-your-own-adventure, story-based puzzle game that uses words to influence its scenery, let us use our own words to be a good influence for our society. If you like this video, then you'll most likely like this one, so click now!